Now, similar to F3, if we're moving along here, is the F8 command. That's going to activate and deactivate ortho, uh, which basically snaps your lines to a horizontal or a vertical line forcing you to draw at 90 degree angles. This is super helpful for those drawing parts like these as well as floor plans since 99% of the time you're going to want your walls and corners to be at 90 degree angles. So if I type in polyline now and hit enter, now that I've tapped F8, it's going to snap to the horizontal or vertical. There are no other options so I am only drawing perpendicular 90 degree lines. Now this, like I mentioned, is a huge time saver because with that and combined with dynamic input, which is this button down here at the bottom, you can now simply type in measurements. So I've clicked, I can now type in how long this line is. Let's say it's six inches. I can move my mouse down and I can say this one's eight inches, eight and enter. And over here, we're going two inches and now up six and over four and then type C for close. So you can see I've drawn this L shape here all at 90 degree angles with just a few quick type commands and it's all locked to that 90 degree angle. So tapping F8 is going to turn ortho on and off. Again, that can also be clicked on and off in the bottom kind of status bar here where most of these commands can be activated by clicking as well. But as I mentioned, if you've got one hand on the mouse and one on the keyboard, this is just a simple natural reaction and becomes second nature as you use the software longer and longer.